everybody, it's Dina with Paper Guacamole. Um, sorry I had to add this last video. I was not able to get all of the trim in my last video. Um, this is a beautiful um, lime green uh, chiffon that has this red sari trim on it. Um, again, these are cut from vintage saris, and this is vintage sari trim. This trim has these beautiful, um, it's a gold kind of a fabric uh, flower that's in the, in the background. There are sequins around the flower along with embroidery thread, gold embroidery thread. And at the center of each flower um, are either uh, green or um, white, silver uh, bling on them. So we'll just kind of take you through um, the whole uh, trim. Again, I will be um, sharing these in form of um, mixes in my Etsy store. Um, I will be working on that uh, in the next couple of days and the listings uh, will be coming up very soon. The next trim is a beautiful, uh, it's a very light um, purple, um, almost like a, a very light eggplant color. And um, the trim is a very thick trim. There are flowers on this trim. Um, you know, there it's kind of a rose color flower with a, a pretty, pretty uh, brown embroidery thread and like a beige embroidery thread with green leaves throughout. Um, let's see here. So there we go. The next piece, um, you know, I just love uh, flowers and roses and colors and bling, and this has all of it. The back, uh, the part of the sorry, the fabric part, it's a very, very um, sheer fabric that has almost like a velvet pattern on it. Um, there are bling kind of throughout, but the main focus is going to be the trim. The trim. Um, has these beautiful, um, almost like a burgundy red uh, rose on them with um, teal colored roses. And this would be maybe a um, peach color rose. So this is a really beautiful trim. The next trim is um, totally embroidered. Um, on this um, white background and it looks like they stamped the design in the background um, so that they I guess would know where to run the embroidery on here. It has these beautiful uh, peacocks in this um, turquoise blue with yellow flowers and these pretty pink little uh, flowers or medallions on the bottom. The next trim is this beautiful, uh, heavily beaded trim. It's on there's there's um, it's on the fab the fabric has frayed and kind of it's sticking to the trim because these um, sequins have a seed bead on the tops of them. So there it's a very raised pattern on this uh, vintage trim. There are blue and red flowers. There is a beautiful kind of a scalloped. Um, design in the middle. There are iridescent sequins with seed beads on top along the borders here and um, sorry along the borders here and along this design here with red uh, red and blue flowers throughout. So this that you see here this is actually um, part of the I guess it caught on the fabric um, and I'll be kind of clean, cleaning that up, but there, there's not that many um, little fabric threads on here. This vintage trim that I'm gonna show you is a beautiful, I don't think that the lighting is really gonna pick up the color as bright as it is, but this is almost like a mustard yellow, almost to an orange color. Not quite tangerine, more on the yellow side, but it has these beautiful embroidered flowers on it. There are red flowers and little blue flowers um, with the green leaves and there's two, two tones of green on the leaves and two tones of blue on the flowers. There's a little bit of staining here. Again, this is on the fabric. 
um, that the embroidery is on up on the top, but on the actual embroidery, um, there are no stains. Um, there's lots of sequins throughout. Let's see. I have two more to show you. This piece I fell in love with. Um, it is, um, it has little paisleys up on the top in green, orange, and pink. And there's a beautiful design here in blue, orange, and green. And then this piece, um, there is a red ribbon that runs through the background, but on top of that ribbon or trim, is it's heavily embroidered. And there are sequins throughout. So this is, you know, a really gorgeous piece, and I'm excited that I'm going to be adding it to the mix. The last trim I have to show you is, um, this is the part of the sari, obviously, that it was cut from. Uh, let me turn this around, actually. So you have, again, a very thick embroidered piece of trim. Um, the trim itself, it, it's, it's in great condition. There is, it looks like there's two trims that were sewn together. You have this beautiful burgundy and gold trim, and then you have this trim with the embroidery stitching on it. Now, where the trim meets the embroidery, um, there is a little bit of uh, color that has run on here. Maybe it was washed and the color, uh, you know, ran into this part or this border, but it actually looks like it iridescent because it goes from, you know, a light pink to a lighter pink and then it just kind of blends in with, with this embroidery. So anyway, I'm um, sorry to do such a quick video, but since I added a fourth one, I tried to make it short and sweet and here I am at seven minutes. So anyway, um, please subscribe, come visit my shop on Etsy. Uh, check out my social media handles down in the description box and have a great day. Bye.